Louis had a very strong Christian faith. And there is a scripture and it says, like a tree planted by the water, I shall not be moved. The fact that this tree was next to this creek seemed to be a powerful reflection of Louis's faith. Louis had been very clear that he wanted to have a tree where his ashes could be scattered at the roots. So I wanted to find a place um, where I could have a tree permanently. And when the time came, we could also spread Imani's ashes next to her dad's, which was something that he had specifically asked for. We picked a, a really small tree because we knew that it would grow to be really big, um, and then it would be a, around for a, a while so that people could come and see it. I think it was like the peacefulness of this area that um, really spoke to us. The day that he passed, I was with him. I say to him, this body that has housed you for all of these years has released you. You are free of pain, you're free of fatigue, you're free of frustration, you're free to dance. And it felt like I was filled with this light and this overwhelming joy. He was free to be. None of us know what's on the other side of this, but I am here to tell you that I know that Louis in a better place. I miss him, but there's not a sadness when I think about this whole experience, this forest, the day that he passed. I feel that a setting like this kind of makes room for people to bring whatever meaning they want or whatever is special or sacred to them. They can experience that here. I never got the feeling that this was a business transaction. It really feels like folks care about what they're doing, that this is about a higher purpose, and that this has meaning. Better Place Forest is definitely the right place for Louis. I would say Better Place Forest really is a better place. I sort of feel relieved knowing that this is where he'll be.